Hey Plungers, it's Rob with Inyo Pools. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Matronix Dolphin Explorer E20 Robotic Pool Cleaner. It's designed for in-ground pools up to 32 feet long and it can work on a variety of surfaces including gunite, fiberglass, and vinyl. Let's go ahead and take a look at some of the features. The Dolphin E20 Cleaner comes with 49 feet of cable. It also includes a power supply with a built-in timer. So if you wanted to leave the cleaner in the pool, you could set this to run uh, once a week, three times a week, or four times a week. Uh, there is no Bluetooth control of this cleaner. The filter on the E20 is easily accessible through the top here. And it comes with what they call the leaf net canister, which is really good for leaves and larger debris. Um, if you've got a lot of sand and finer stuff, I'd recommend this cartridge upgrade, which we'll link to in the video. The E20 comes with a 24 month warranty. Uh, it's 12 months on the cable. Uh, it doesn't cover what they consider wearable parts, which would be the brush, the track, or the filters. Uh, but let's go ahead and get this thing in the water and test it out. So you want to position the power supply at least 12 feet from the pool. So we've got that plugged in. We've got the cable from the cleaner plugged into the power supply. We'll go ahead and drop the cleaner into the pool. All right, so the first thing I notice, this cleaner is about 14 pounds. It's a couple pounds lighter than my other cleaner, so that's nice. Much easier to move around. I'll go ahead and turn it on. All right, the cleaner is off and running. Cleaning cycle on this one is two hours. I've got a 14 by 28 pool, so we'll see how long it takes to cover this one. So it ran for two hours and shut off, and the bottom is completely clean. So it's like it did its job. Let's go ahead and pull it out. Uh, when you're pulling out the cleaner, you pull it by the cord up to the water surface. So once you get it up to the water surface, you want to grab it by the handle. You don't want to pull it up by the cord. Let's go ahead and open it up. All right, so got a bunch of leaves, some grass clippings. It actually did get quite a bit of dirt. So that's pretty impressive, even with the the standard uh, leaf canister. A couple of final observations on the cleaner. I uh, did a really good job on my pull. I didn't have that much. Uh, in there, but it cleaned it all up within about 30 minutes and I just let it finish out the two-hour run cycle 
um, it climbed the wall several times, brushed the tile line. Um, these type of cleaners, they don't, uh, nobody guarantees that they're going to clean the steps or the sun shelves, but this one did, I noticed it climbed up on the bottom uh, step, um, but that not, might not be the case in every pool. Um, but overall, you know, I'm, I'm uh, pretty impressed with this cleaner, so I would definitely recommend it. Um, if you have any questions about the Dolphin Explorer E20 or anything pool or spa related, visit us over annualpools.com. Thanks for watching.